Here, uh, Detroit. Uh, your name, ma'am? Bree Lauren. Bree, and how old are you, Bree? Um, I'm 33. 33. Uh, uh, where are you from? Um, I'm from Detroit. Detroit. Now I take these videos and I upload them to YouTube. You okay with that? I am. Okay. So, uh, how long have you been around this area? Um, I've been around this area for about two years. Two years. Okay. And uh, you have any substance <laughs> abuse problems? If you could talk up a little too, that'd be good. Okay. What is it? Yes, I do. Which ones? Um, I do crack. Is that it, crack? Yes. And how long have you been doing that? Since I was 17. Oh, all this time, huh? Yes. Now, people, when I read and I talk to people, they say crack's not addictive. What's your take on that? Well, I was addicted to heroin. Okay. And then, of course, crack. But, I mean, it, it's more mental. It is? Yes. Okay. And how long's a hit of that last you when you do it? Not long at all. <laughs> okay. Not long. Okay. And you're a working girl? Yes, I am. You've been doing that as long as well? No, I've been doing that for about a year. Okay. And what type of jobs have you had in your life? Regular um, jobs? I mean, I've worked at McDonald's. I also, um, I had a nursing job and I was going to school for nursing. But, like, when I had went and uh, was going to school, I was also working in a house. Oh, okay. And then I went and did a pickup in Ohio, and I caught two uh, drug felonies. Okay, so you spent some time in prison? No, I uh, I did some time in uh, jail, and then they made me go to rehab. And I was clean for about six and a half years, and then I went through a divorce, lost a child, and relapsed. Okay, I'm sorry to hear that. Now, uh, this this area out here is this? Are you? Are you considered homeless? Yes. You are. Yes. So where do you find, how do, where do you live like on a typical night? Um, I mean, I stay in people's rooms. Uh, sometimes my dates will allow me to stay, but then you're kicked out and you don't have nowhere to go. So, I mean, I've slept, slept underneath trees. Um, just anywhere I can. Oh. And how about uh, the winters? Just the same deal? Just trying to hang in there wherever you can, huh? Yeah. yeah. I've slept underneath, like went into apartments, slept underneath the stairs, downstairs in the basement. Okay. Is there uh, any words of advice you can give a young girl that's on the fence about considering using drugs at a young age to avoid this life? Any Anything that comes to mind? Get different help. <laughs> go see like a counselor or something and go to a different life and don't go down this path. Yeah, okay. It's hard. Yeah, it's a difficult life. I know people don't understand it. Mm -hmm. Now, uh, do you ever have little brief intermissions of like a good day? I mean, is, is there anything that, that, that puts you in a good mood or are you just so far down in the hole that drugs is the only thing that seemed to make you feel better? Honestly, like even when I um, was like clean, it was, it's like you don't know what to do with yourself. You don't, you don't really know who you are. Yeah, okay. You know. How about this? Your favorite childhood memory? When I was with my family. Okay. Do you have a favorite movie? Dirty Dancing. <laughs> what's, it, what's the name of it? Dirty Dancing. Oh, okay. Favorite book? Uh, no, I don't really read. Okay. Now, uh, do you... Uh, you know, I, inter I interview a lot of women in this situation. Like, what could people do to help you get over the hump? I mean, I mean, it's, sometimes I just think, God, I don't know what to do, you know? And that's an honest answer because I don't. It is interesting interviewing you. It's interesting how women get out here, how they stay out there, how some leave, some don't. But I just, it's depressing that I don't really think I'm doing any good. I don't think I'm doing any bad. I'm basically just getting your story and giving you a little stipend for five minutes of your time. What could people do out there to truly help people like you rather than get criticized for enabling? What, 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 what's, help me with this. I mean, Sometimes food. Okay. <laughs> clothes. Speaking of, do you need some clothes? Yes. I got quite a few. I do. Good. I do. I don't. I don't have anything, and what I did have was stolen. Okay. Well, I got clothes for you now. Okay. Will you have any questions for me? I mean, 
what is where's I don't I don't even know. Like I don't know. We'll no? talk afterwards. <laughs> oh, that's it? I said I don't know, we'll talk afterwards. <laughs> okay, well let me get this uh, let me let you go through these clothes. Okay. And uh, there's a lot of stuff to pick from. Okay. Nice stuff people send. I appreciate this interview and I thank you for it. Thank you. You have a good day. You too.